If you're watching this video, you're probably wondering how in the world did I get my hands on this bottle? Well, stay tuned, I got a method for you. Welcome back everybody. My name is Ben Jackson. Today I'll be your bourbon expert for the art of doing. Got my hands on a bottle of Blanton's. If you saw my last video, I'll leave a link up above. It's about the best bourbon that money can't buy. Well, it turns out money can buy this bottle of bourbon. I eventually tracked it down and paid $100 for it, and I'll tell you what happened. I went to a bunch of stores. I mean a bunch. Probably over a dozen looking for this thing. First couple I went to, I was just looking at the shelf, seeing if they had some on the shelf, and I learned later that was a foolish endeavor. There wasn't going to be any on the shelf. I went to several smaller liquor stores, and they basically laughed at me. We never get Blanton's. I never have it. I went to a few bigger stores, and they laughed at me and said, yes, we get it in so uh, every so often, but we put it up for raffle. Um, if you buy a bunch of things, you can get more tickets in the raffle sign your name on this wait list, we'll put you on the raffle, etc., etc. Well, I wasn't looking to wait until winter to get my hands on a chance to buy some Blanton's, so I formulated a plan. And if you're really looking to get your hands on a bottle, this might be what you do. My first thought was to sit down and call every store within a million miles of me until I found one that had it. And I thought that there was probably a lot of people doing that. And I figured a better way was to go into every store that I passed and ask them a series of questions. Question number one, do you have Blanton's? This gives them the opportunity to laugh in your face and then feel sorry for you, hopefully. Next question is, do you ever get Blanton's in? And this will lead into my third question, how often and when do you get the Blanton's in? Some of them told me they'd be lucky to get some in every couple of months, they'd get a bottle or two. Some stores told me they got two bottles every couple of weeks. And that gave me some hope. The last question you want to ask is, when do you get it in? Do you get it Wednesday morning? Do you get it last shipment on Friday and that way you can kind of set yourself up for okay this store gets it on the third Wednesday of every month if they get it or how many bottles are they going to get on that day. I started making a list of stores that got it in on frequently enough basis and what day they got it in but I didn't stop. I kept on going because I have dogged determination and I'm crazy and I really wanted to try it by maybe not quite 20 stores locally, but uh, over a dozen stores. I had a couple of stores that I was pretty sure that if I followed up on the days they got their shipments, after a month or so, I'd be able to find it. Well, I popped into a store that I had never been to before. That being said, I think it would be helpful and advantageous if you set up a relationship with a store that got it in often. They're probably not going to set it aside for you because everybody is looking for Blanton's, but you might get a little more information or a little more heads up on when they might get it. I eventually popped into a store that I've never been in before and didn't look too promising. It wasn't a very big store and usually the tiny and small stores don't get any in. I popped in this store, asked them if they had it, and the lady said, huh, I think I do. I think I have one bottle left. She popped in the back. She said, I do. And she handed me this bottle. I paid $99 for it. Off I went on my way. Maybe flies in the face of, you can't buy this bottle, but evidently you can. So I'm very anxious to taste it. And I'll unbox it, taste it, and show you what's inside this box on this video. There's no video there. I haven't released it yet. So keep coming back and stay tuned. Let's always remember to practice responsible drinking. Let's practice kindness, compassion, humility. Thanks for being with me to help me practice my art, the art of doing it.